Hey YouTube, I'm doing an update video on Marine Corps stuff. Went to a gun show. Got a 44 dated 1943 E-Tool. Let's see, 1944 Dave Manufacturing Company. And here, I'll undo the strap here. Forty-five. Yep, USAMES. Don't know what company that stands for or anything, but yeah, it's in good condition. Only minor surface rust. Got it for thirty dollars, which is a really good deal. Compared to, I mean, if you were to buy reproduction, it'd be like fifty something bucks. So yeah, it's in good condition. A little bit of dirt, but no big deal. Very good condition. Good for my. Um, if I were to ever do a uh, Iwo Jima or an Okinawa impression, it would go good with my Korean War impression. And if I ever got into Marine Corps, Vietnam, sometime in the future, if I ever, whenever I'm done with my World War II and Korean War. So yeah, I got that. And where did I put this? Just a little side note on my K-Bar. Um, put it over in the sunlight so it actually looks the color it actually is. Instead of it being like a reddish orange that it came, put some leather care stuff on it and darkened it down. Pretty good. It's nice. And then I'm reading with the old breed, E.B. Sledge. Very good book. There's a few slight differences from the movie that are incorrect. So like um, in the movie, um, when Eugene was pulling some gold teeth out of a jab, and um, Snafu told him not to do it because there were germs, but in in the book it was actually the doc, their corpsman, who said that. And then another thing that I found out was like the um when the one guy in Pelulu had diarrhea and went to go relieve himself, he a Japanese guy came out of the the cave, but on the book he stepped on him because the guy was laying down trying to play dead. So yeah, just a few differences, but it's alright. Very good book. I'm going to read that one next. I'm like halfway done with that, and I've only had it two days, so. It's kind of a side note about this hatchet. Works real nice. We have some brush. Good for chopping that down. And then I got my, um, bring that over here. There's like that 80s loaded off with my shotgun. Put like the K bar on there. I have the shot two shotgun shell pouches and then two canteens and a medic pouch. With the first aid contents in it. There's that. And then I got a gun safe. I um it's a hundred dollars, it's a sentinel. Um holds ten guns, real nice. Also got some uh, razor blades for like 50 cents each or something like that. So, yeah, I got it. Very nice. It was $100 brand new. So I thought oh, that would be nice. Here, I'll get the key out. And we will open it. And there, get the flashlight. There's my shotgun. Yeah, very nice. Remington 870. My favorite, well, my favorite shotgun. So yeah, just a little side thing. So yeah, that's the update video. So comment, rate, subscribe.